This is Mrs. Green. She is enjoying a mild summer evening on her terrace. If only those lights from the wind farm weren't blinking continuously. Nonetheless, Mrs. Green really appreciates green electricity generated by wind power. But soon, the blinking may be history. A new technology, which is recommended by the International Wind Turbine Standard, IEC 61400, is available, and some countries have already implemented it. This technology is called Aircraft Detection Lighting System, or ADLS in short. One of the leading aircraft detection lighting systems was designed by LightGuard. It is transponder-based and uses multilateration to achieve the best possible results. But what does that mean? Transponder-based? What is multilateration? And how does it keep the wind turbines from blinking? Let's start from the top. Wind turbines are equipped with obstruction lights to be visible in the dark for air traffic. Every flying object, whether aircraft, helicopter or drone, is under obligation to send out transponder signals to be identifiable. Those can be signals in the form of mode S, mode AC, mode ADS-B or FLAM. Now, light guard receivers are installed all over the country, mostly on wind turbines but in other elevated places as well. They receive transponder signals and assign timestamps and position of the receiver to them. This information is transmitted to the light guard data center, which then calculates the location and trajectory of the flying object. This is done using the time differences of the receive signals and distance differences of all receivers. Since everything is interconnected, the system receives continuous data from all receivers at once and is therefore able to achieve a higher network coverage than each individual receiver would by itself. Consequently, the network of receivers is more accurate in detecting the positions of all flying objects. This leads to a better signal quality and more lights-off times for each wind turbine, especially in areas with high air traffic or large wind farms. But how exactly do the lights get turned off? Additionally, the light guard data center continuously communicates with the light control unit in the wind farm, which controls the lights. As long as no flying object is near the wind farm, the light signal is suppressed, the lights are off. If a flying object approaches, the suppression is lifted, the lights turn on. Depending on the location, light emissions can be reduced almost completely. Air traffic safety is also taken care of. In the event of a signal failure, the obstruction lighting is no longer suppressed and the lights remain switched on. Important to know for wind farm owners and operators, the light guard system can be installed in all kind of wind turbines. As an experienced supplier in the wind industry, light guard cooperates with all wind turbine manufacturers. Aircraft detection lighting system from light guard to make the night sky dark again. For Mrs. Green and for the acceptance of wind power.